Welcome on YouTube, welcome back to the Great YouTube channel where we talk about spirituality, all the spiritual aspects of life. Today we are going to deal with um, the metaphysics of marijuana and other psychedelics, but most of marijuana because they don't eat a lot really use. Try magic mushroom one time. Yeah, I'm going to tell you about the experience too. So just tune in, stay tuned for psychedelics and spirituality. You can find out why psychedelics are banned. Get to the pharmaceuticals that kill off people and all them shit, but they are legal. And alcohol, there is alcohol poison. I'm not sure about the statistics, but it's a lot. It's a huge percent of deaths per year from alcohol poisoning. And there is zero deaths from marijuana, you know, so, <laughs> or anything marijuana related. Like, zero, zero, zero. Even drinking and driving is a next um, thing from. Alcohol, you know, so alcohol that kill people like fly. <laughs> people that did like fly from alcohol for a year, and it is allowed to be easier. So, I don't know, I don't really understand why. So, I'll try if it will understand why. <laughs> We're gonna go in and this morning. If you see my turn, I will call for the right, but like, they all look at the Well, not a park, but the next door. I bored all the people jog and them shit there, so I also see me a look around for a while. Well, I don't even have to look around, but I also see people are fast in the back room. Don't mind that. And then I have my dog right there, so, so I'm really a watch. Mostly. <laughs> yeah, so, marijuana and spirituality, you know, all of the psychedelics they will help you bring a higher level of consciousness or a higher awareness is banned. Why? When I get it, and then people, some people are thinking, oh, the government care about you, make care about the people, make them ban certain things. No, the government really actually don't care about it. That's why they ban things because marijuana is a healing plant. You get to me, I say it's a healing plant. Ayahuasca, healing. Most psychedelics are healing plant. It heals trauma, it heals things in your body. So you have to bring up the thing in your subconscious, you deal with it like ayahuasca. You bring up all your traumas, them. Ayahuasca bring up all your traumas them, from the young, you know, never deal with it. I try to escape by drinking alcohol. Al alcohol is an escape drug, an escape substance, whatever it is. You drink it and you forget all your problems, but then your problems still come back on face you <laughs> by Monday morning because you drink out all your weekend and forget all of the work stress and then by go back to work, the stress is still there. So learn to deal with it, learn to heal it and not try to escape. So leave the alcohol, check out marijuana, check out ayahuasca, check out mushrooms. So, alright, my experience with mushrooms now was it's similar to the eye where you get off a weed, it's just that it actually makes you real like you get like this outer body feeling. Like, you, you literally, when I take the mushroom, it literally makes me feel like it. My body kind of separate from me, it makes me realize it. the eye, the real eye is not the body because I get from not, not, not experience the body, like, really and truly I experience the body, like, I feel. <laughs> I don't know, you have to, you have to um, try mushrooms, you know, what I mean? but it's different from it. Not far different, but you give a total different experience. Um, it uh, makes you more, it make you way more aware in this state, you know, and you know, put it to sleep, like, we need to actually keep you up. And make you super aware of everything that happens about you. Know, subconsciously, consciously, and every way, you know, just make you super aware of everything. You start to get some down, you start to understand life better. You start to understand why things happen, you know. You just confront your fears and your worries and your doubts. You understand why you go through them. And you know, you upgrade as a person. Because your consciousness is upgrade. You learn something else. You understand something deeper. So that's the good and that's the healing from the plant here. You get to understand life. Now, a being where I go around and do understand life. A dead person, because why you don't live on a planet that you know I understand how the planet works, how you know what I go on metaphysically. Life is not physical enough, we cannot get that yet. Then go around and take a place and look on the physical. No, this is a spiritual reality. You have to check out and find out what the physical are that the laws of control of the universe. Right there, they are like Google the fool <laughs> with your head like, well, without your head, I look like headless chicken because. You don't know the laws of the universe, you don't know how the universe operates, so you are a stress. And I realize the stress are attract all your problems there because you're not worrying the hell, no. 
So you have an angel try to understand where you live, you have try to understand how to communicate with the environment. It's not you praying to a God. No. Come first, you've been trying that all your life and you get this to no results. You have to start believing in yourself and start understanding the laws of physics, the laws of control of the universe, the laws of metaphysics. You know? So now, with all the psychedelics, the money put up on the pan. Cigarette, legal, with this tobacco. Tobacco is a poison. Tobacco is poison to the body. They know that tobacco not help you nothing more than fuck your lungs and get cancer. Activate the cancer cells in your lungs. But it's still it's legal. And marijuana, which is the plant that marijuana is the first plant that humans started to cultivate. Research that is the first plant out of every other plant. Humans used to eat fruits, I used to eat fruit. We used to use every other herb and veggies and everything. But we started cultivating marijuana first. That, that's really the importance of the plant. The plant never important. Our ancestors would start cultivating it in such um, massive numbers, you know. Because we knew the importance of these things. So we start cultivating it first. You know? Because we know that raise your awareness, connect it to the gods, connect it to our ourselves. And that's what it do. Now the system know this too. That's why them say it's illegal. And they used to kill people for it. <laughs> kill people for use it. In a Jamaica, they used to put it in a prison for fucking years. If you use it, they catch it with a board or it, you know. And it's a plant. Why people have so hard, why people have so people have prison for it and all that shit. It's a plant. Just like skeleton, <laughs> onion, the herb. You know, nothing about the guy deals with onion and tomato and skeleton. Or tobacco or alcohol. But see them guy deals with marijuana. So just look deeper than anything, people. I realize that this thing actually activate the DNA and connect it to your higher self it, de it helps decalcify your pineal gland, your pineal gland you have an endocannabinoid cannabinoid system in your body you will go on and on with your immune system check it out man do some research deeper into it don't understand my word I realize why they might try to find that thing out the most powerful, one of the most powerful herbs on the planet the high vibrational plant so check the levels <laughs> and go deeper into it and just realize man say herb is the 